some of you may remember that a couple of months ago I did an unboxing here on the channel of this Lady Death uh, majestic statue that I got in from the great folks over at Coffin Comics and it came in damaged and I was pretty disappointed and here we are a little over two months later and I got the replacement in the mail and that is what I am going to be unboxing in today's video what's up everybody Trinity here welcome back to the second street Marvel if you're not already please make sure you subscribe click the little bell and all that good stuff and when you click the little bell make sure that you uh, click it got a little menu that, that pops up pops up and click the all button so you get all those notifications also uh, share this video while with your friends leave some comments down in the comments section as well thank you all so much for being here today uh, where yes I am going to finally unbox this Lady Death Majestic Series statue uh, here in case you didn't see a couple of months ago this did come in and I was pretty disappointed but I knew the great folks over at Coffin Comics would do everything in their power to make sure that I got a replacement for uh, this uh, for the damaged statue and a huge shout out to all the folks over at Coffin Comics who are there uh, working hard like pretty much uh, every single day because they've got a full-on production going on over there. They got their uh, comics that they're doing, different series, as well as different things that they are doing, uh, like even things here with uh, some of these statues and things like that that they are starting to get into. And I know they recently did one not too long ago that I didn't get to do of Hell Witch, and I really wish I could have got that Hell Witch statue, but um, just, you know, a little too, little too much, a little too often, can't do it. So, you know, maybe one of these days, if they have it on, uh, their Coffin Comics, uh, their, their shop, uh, maybe I'll pick it up there, but, uh, until then, well, I guess I didn't get one, but, you know, hey, you know, one of these days, maybe. Let's go ahead and skip right past all of the pleasantries and get right into this box here and get this thing out of here so we can see what it looks like getting this thing opened up as you can see we've got the base right here which you know the base wasn't damaged on the last one but you know so the um the base is the base is all uh fine so take a look at the base there and this is number 78 of 200 now let's get this thing let's get lady death herself out of here and see what she is looking like all right, man, this thing, whew, not damaged this time. Very happy about that. And uh, I don't feel, you know, I don't feel, uh, you know, I feel, it feels better holding it. It's not, you know, with her leg not jiggling around, feeling like it's, uh, you know, going to fall apart in my hand. Like, well, like the last one was already falling apart. But, oh, man, this thing, uh, this thing looks absolutely Great, let's go ahead and get this on the stand and show you guys what this thing looks like. And here we go, this is the Lady Death Majestic Statue Series. This is the Heaven Sent Edition and this thing is absolutely uh, beautiful from uh, from the top even all the way down uh, to the base here uh, this thing is absolutely uh, beautiful and I don't think that even the camera here uh, picks up how absolutely beautiful this statue uh, really really is you can see how it's like a uh, champagne colored all through uh, her leggings there and then into her little suit it's all got a champagne color where she is more is all white you know with uh, her white skin uh, absolutely uh, beautiful uh, statue uh, here and it's, it's very nice on the detail getting into uh, even like the hair and things like that go ahead and get in here a little bit closer just looking at uh, the detail there on her face and even in the suit uh, the nice texture on the hair really do uh, like this as well very great stuff I mean you can even see like kind of the coloring uh, that really went into uh, a lot of 
that detail there on uh, on her little on, on her like her arm her arms there her armings I guess or what would those be her her, uh, her gloves I guess if you will and then even getting down in here uh, into her suit uh, is very very nice as well uh, the little details uh, even like uh, on the little straps that she has here uh, they look you know like they're probably like a, a like a cloth or like a leather um, in there as well. And you can see even uh, getting getting here into the uh, into the cape here as it flows down. It's got a nice flow to it as well. I mean, it looks very I don't know, kind of I guess kind of natural, but it is uh, made of that same kind of like uh, hard plaster or whatever uh, I believe this is uh, made of here. Just, I don't know, man. This, this thing is beautiful. It's a nice statue. Like I said, you uh, to see seeing it here on 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 video is is one thing, but if you're actually seeing this thing uh, in person, man, it makes just uh, the biggest difference. So there we have it, ladies and gentlemen, the Lady Death Majestic Statue. Uh, this is the Heaven Sent Edition from the great folks over at Coffin Comics. And again, a huge shout out to Brian Polito and all the staff over there at Coffin Comics who are working hard to take care of their customers through uh, their uh, through their regular shop that they have online, as well as all of the people who go to their uh, projects and crowdfund them, uh, crowdfund them, help support their projects and bring them to life. And uh, they are one of the best. They were probably like the gold standard in crowdfunding when it comes to their comic books and um, the quality in which they are doing it and the communication with the customers and things like that. And even taking care of their customers who get in things like this, like these statues, like I did a couple of months ago when this thing uh, came in. It was damaged. I was very disappointed, but they had another one there uh, ready to go to send me it just took a little bit of time for them to assess all of the damages and they got one sent out immediately now this thing did come out um uh this thing actually uh arrived here uh, on my doorstep at the beginning of july but it's just been a little bit busy so this is about three weeks ago that this thing uh finally came in the mail it was right after the 4th of July, but uh, that's it right there, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know what you think down in the comments below about this beautiful, beautiful Lady Death statue. I want to know all your thoughts down in the comments below, and man, I'm, I'm telling you, I like this thing, man. This is absolutely beautiful. I'm going to have to buy one of those display cases to get this thing, and if you'd like to help me get there, uh, make sure that you like this video, share it out with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and also tell your friends to subscribe, and if you like what you see here on this channel and want to continue to support it with your hard-earned dollars, consider becoming one of the Myrtle Maniacs, one of our channel members where uh, one of the things we do is we go out there and pick different crowdfunded projects, what I do with the, uh, some of the money from that. And I also do giveaways for some of those books as well, as well as I am getting ready to do a giveaway for Lady Death Chapter 14. This is Sacrificial Annihilation that we are getting ready to give a copy away to one of our lucky channel members. Soon after that, we will be giving away another uh, one of the books from the Coffin Comics universe. But that's all I've got for this video, folks. Thank you all so much for being here today. You all have a very good day, and we'll see you in the next video. Later.